guys it is our day at sea today so we had a nice relaxing morning um we are gonna go for breakfast right now but i well, i still woke up at seven but then i just stayed in bed and read um nice thing is we do have a coffee maker um so we don't have to go up on deck to get coffee we can just make it here it's not the best but it's fine um it is dan's birthday today so i brought along some whoa you can see me um little birthday decals there's one there and then can't see the but behind the curtain that's kind of bathroom area um where dad's having a shower but there's some more back there um yee, happy birthday to him we're gonna do a lot of relaxing today on deck we did see there's a couple things um that we want to see like at three o'clock there's an abba tribute song afternoon going on i don't know so we're gonna try to go to that we do have a dinner reservation at 5 45 um at la cucina that's how you say it. Um, it's the Italian where they have risotto. So I'm looking forward to that. I've been looking forward to that all week. We wanted to do it on our sea day because we knew we'd have time. We wouldn't be like rushing back from um, an excursion. And as well as, yeah, it's his birthday. so a little special thing. <laughs> so right now I'm just going to go, well, finish getting ready for Dan and then having some breakfast. Oh, it's a nice roll again. It looks nice and quiet. Good. Although there weren't a lot of people there. All, almost all the seats were saved with towels, so when people are having breakfast now. So there's more on 18 aft up at the top. There's no bar there, but it's nice to um, lay down. So hopefully we can find something there. So this goes from deck 15, the pool deck, up to 18, where I think it's just seats. But oh, this is line no, look at that. <laughs> that is the nicest. This is more of our style. No one around. Only downside, it does get really hot and you're not near a pool, so you can't just cool off, but it's nice and quiet. Thing, these cushions, let's go back here. And the water. It's a nice quiet area and it's a great view. It's having water for now because it's still like 10. Took a quick dip to cool off, have my drink. Now I'm going back up on deck. Air temperature 25 Celsius or 77 Fahrenheit. Sea temperature is 81 Fahrenheit, 27 Celsius. Hmm. Got another drink. Maybe see, I think it's Bailey's. Got it, yes, two days ago. Bailey's, a lot of eggs, and banana. I'm already on deck. But we're going inside for some lunch. This edition of breakfast and I'm just going to walk this thing This is where we're having dinner tonight. But it's so much less crowded. Yay! So we get a window seat. And this is my lunch. But I have some lo mein. That's a cauliflower burrito. Somewhere to find what you had today. Some edamame, some pasta, some more edamame, and then my baked salad. After I sat down with my plate, I remembered I wanted to have a veggie burger because at the burger station it says you can also request a veggie burger. But then they also have a pasta station made to order. Both of those things would sound good. But I got this. Once we like it down here, nice and quiet. We've got some coffee and a variety of dessert that I brought. <laughs> Chocolate cookies, crumble, and we see... Are we thinking that's, Corsica over that's there. Sardinia. Sardinia? And then, okay, we're still pretty far away, but I can see. The berry crumble is delicious. It's warm and it has, uh, or I put on top, a vanilla cream, vanilla sauce on it. It's so good. The chocolate cake tastes very similar to my melting cake yesterday. That also was not very melting cake. It's just a very dense cake. I think it's the same thing, but in a different formation. <laughs> Still good though, but yesterday was not melting cake. We got back to our room and changed. Um, I loved those two places that we found this morning. It was so relaxing, so nice. I wish we would have found them earlier. Um, like, you can go underneath for the breakfast and lunch. Always, we've just never been, and it's so much quieter there and beautiful views. You like, there's not a lot of people that go down there, so you're almost guaranteed to get a window seat. And it's just, yeah, a lot more relaxing. We stayed there for about 
I'd say 45 minutes or an hour just after with coffee and talking and you can actually hear each other talk and not like kids screaming and running around. Um, yeah, it was really nice. And then the upper deck, it's on deck 18. It's amazing and it's again so quiet. Um, you don't have the like noise from the kids in the pool, but also you don't have the noise like or the music playing, which sometimes I like, but often if I'm reading, um, I like just concentrating on my book. Uh, but yeah, it was really nice. And there isn't like a bar or a pool, but there is a bartender that walks around and they'll take your orders. So I had two drinks, they were very good. <laughs> so yeah, now it is almost three o'clock. So we're gonna head down to the Epic Theater and watch the ABBA tribute. And then we're thinking we may go play some bowling. I have a pair of socks with me. Um, you do have to pay $7 a game. So I hope it's a game, not per person. But, um, I don't know, it'd still be something fun. Who can say that they've been bowling on a cruise ship? Not many people. Except everyone who would be on this epic, and I'm sure some other cruise line. But still, not many people. <laughs> He thought I'm almost as good at him as him. So far, I'm already got nine. He only got one. Bowling was fun. Expensive, but fun. It was seven dollars per person per game, so fourteen bucks. And then they asked for a tip, <laughs> but, well, um, but no, we enjoyed it. So now we're gonna actually hand sanitize my hands. Got our drinks. Going up to a room. I'm trying a rebellious fish. It is very good. It tastes like a what is that breakfast one called? Mimosa. It tastes like a mimosa, but then it has little fish <laughs> fruit parts or fruit floating around it that look like little fishies. <laughs> And I'm getting ready to go to our dinner. All right, we quickly got ready for our dinner. Um, I didn't have time to curl, curl my f like whole hair, so I just have it in my typical twist, but then I curled to the back, so yeah. And my outfit today, shoes, my shirt that I like. And yeah, let's go to the Italian La Cucina, which is a, you have to, an extra restaurant you do have to pay for. Um, but it's Dan's birthday, and they have something yummy that I want to eat. <laughs> All right, let's go. Super big slices. Will you do a picture of me? So dinner was pretty good. I mean, it wasn't amazing. Um, and it was 65 extra dollars on top of like we're already paying to have food on the cruise So for that were would you think it was worth it? No, I don't know like it was good, but it wasn't Out of this world what we could not have gotten up in the or down in the Manhattan dining room Like it was the service was good and then what was I guess <laughs> bothering us that put us in a not so happy mood. I mentioned earlier this week that they charged us twice for the short excursion that we're doing tomorrow. Um, so we went down there earlier today and they, it was a big thing. They're like, we have to talk to this person and then the finance person and things. Anyways, then they were able to iron it out and they took off the extra charge. So we weren't charged for four tickets for the two of us. We're only charged for two tickets. Um, and we saw that we had it yeah, taken off our account. We thought we were all good. And then right before dinner, we logged onto our account on the Norwegian app and how they rectified it to take the charge off the account. They canceled the tour for us. <laughs> we're not on the tour tomorrow. So now we're gonna go back down to the cruise or the excursion desk and be like, well, we, we're still charged once for it, so we st and we want to go on that cruise or that excursion. Um, we don't want to get there and be like, oh no, we've filled up the seats. You know, someone else signs up for it today for tomorrow, and be like, oh, you can't go. Like, Bleh. so. Anyways, we're gonna try to make that right now, and it's just tricky because now we have to explain the whole situation um, of why it was taken off and all this, but. Fingers crossed we get it back because we're really looking for that's like the big 10 hour excursion that we both 
really want to do so hopefully yeah although now I'm like they're gonna add it back but now we're gonna have another like what seven hundred and ten dollars additional again that we owe so it's just gonna go in a circle but whew, not stressing out even though we were stressing about it all dinner we're just gonna fix it and we'll stress about it later if we can't fix it or if they're like oh no it's all sold out no then we'll get angry but not angry yet just calm <laughs> all right Let's go down there, and then we also do want photos done. Um, fancy dress photos in my nice top. But we, we need to deal with that first. So dealing with that first, then photos. So we did get that sorted out. They did tell us to make sure tomorrow we're not paid for it again, but that's fine. We did some photos, just one, because I have a big pimple. We only lasted listening to three songs for karaoke. Now we're gonna go, there's like a pyramid game. Um, oh my god, the bar's so busy. We're 15 minutes early and all the chairs are already taken. Hmm. We scoped it out. Someone got up, or two, a couple got up. We swooped in, actually. That happened already before. Another guy, we were walking towards it, another guy swooped in. So then we were on top of these seats. As soon as they went up, we're like, they left their wine, but no, we're still we're stealing them. But no, they did, they went away, away, so. back in her room we looked at our onboard account and sure enough we've been charged again another seven hundred and ten dollars for our shore excursions and it's showing up that we're registered for it but the way they did it was to charge us again for it so we now we've even though we got the previous charge taken off the extra shoe tickets now we have paid it again the extra two tickets so four tickets and all <laughs> dan is so mad i was like oh you want me to come he's like nope i'm doing like this Oh dear, uh, he's not happy. Already he was like really stressed this whole dinner. I'm like, well, we'll work it out and stuff. And he's just, yeah, not, it, it's frustrating. Cause like, we're looking to see how much like money we've spent and all that. And I mean, that's a large chunk of money. Um, and like, we're getting off the boat, not tomorrow, but the next day. So I don't want to owe an extra $700 for some, like for extra tickets that we're not doing. Like, so. But aside from that, our evening was good. Um, we watched the pyramid game, which was which was not as funny as other um, of their games and events, but it was still good to see. We have tickets to Priscilla, Queen of the Desert musical tomorrow at seven. So really, I think we're only getting on board again at like six thirty. <laughs> so it's gonna be tight. We may have dinner after, and then we already have to pack. Uh, we'll see. All right, so that's gonna be it today. It's only about 10, um, but I still have to get up at like six. It takes over half an hour for breakfast, kind of going up there and dealing with lines and peoples and stuff. Um, yeah, so getting up at six. So, signing off today. Hopefully everything gets sorted with our excursion cost i will let you know tomorrow if that all got sorted out um and then yeah not tomorrow but the next day we're already getting off the ship and heading to venice um but that's gonna be it tonight so thank you for watching and i'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs> bye